up guys? I'm going to be doing a review here on some different headlights and headlight housings of a 98 Chevy Blazer. This here is a combination of a 55 watt 6000K HID on the right side and a LED light that I bought off of Amazon on the left. I'll cover up one and then the other to show you the difference on lumen output. As you can see my right side is quite a bit brighter. That's the side that has the 55 watt HID in it. If I cover that, there's the LED by itself. This can be on my left headlight. These are in projectors. I'll get a closer look at that here in a moment. All right, there's with the HID. These are both supposed to be 6,000K. I'm gonna cover the left LED headlight. with it back. See the color difference right away on them. They're both supposed to be a 6000K color. Okay, this is above the line, the cutoff line here. Go down below. See there's a clear difference in color there. We have more of a 5000K on the LED and more like a 7 thousand or so on the HID. You can see the brightness difference there is quite a bit on the HID 55 watt. The headlight housings were purchased on Amazon. I paid $189 for the pair. Came with the turn signals up front as well. I converted those both to LEDs. I'll show you what it looks like from inside the vehicle here. Alright, so this is from within. Now I do have one LED on my high beam side right now, I don't have anything on my left. I had to replace the HID bulb on the left because the ballast burnt out. It was a cheap eBay kit, but I paid 16 bucks for the ballast and the bulbs. I uh, wouldn't necessarily recommend it, but uh, you get what you pay for, right? The LEDs I paid $99 a pair for them on Amazon one year ago. Uh, and they still seem to be working reliably. There's a high beam off of one LED on the right side, no bulb in the left. But that'll give you an idea of the difference. I'll post the link in the description for the headlight housings uh, with the projector style lenses on the low beams. And then I will also leave a link for the LEDs that I bought and uh, if you want the HID kit, I can put that there as well. But just to give you an idea, as you can see, well, maybe you can't see at this angle here, but uh, we get a pretty bad um, dark spot from the HID itself. You might be able to see it if I get up here a little further. Pretty bad cold spot from the HID there. It's hard to really pick it up, but just gives you an idea there. Alright. See how bad the cold spot is there. And that's just one HID bulb causing that. Uh, like I said, the other one stopped working. Uh, I've had the HID kit in for about two weeks of use and the ballast burnout for the driver's side. Uh, LEDs I've been running for right at a year. I bought them last year, uh, February 28th. So pretty much right at a year on the LEDs and they still seem to be running strong. So just giving everybody a heads up on quality versus quantity. <laughs> and uh, yeah, thanks for watching.